Hi, today we'll be going over how to build a model in resolution. Start by choosing to design in feet or meters. Next, import any drawings that will be used in the project. Click on File, then Import Drawing. Click Import Drawing and browse to the location on your computer where the JPEG is saved. Scale the drawing by choosing a no measurement with the two red X's. Use the plus button to zoom in for more accuracy. Then type in the known dimension next to ruler length. Determine the XY placement for the drawing by clicking on the position tab. Move the blue X to align the world point. And once complete, click accept to import the drawing. It's now time to build the model. To add a new surface, click the green plus icon indicated above. To modify an existing surface, hover over any of the outer edges, then click and drag to adjust the dimensions. Dimensions may also be keyed in using the properties window. To adjust the drawing after it's imported, Uncheck the lockbox under Properties. It is now possible to move the drawing along the XY coordinates. At this point, let's finish constructing the model. To clone a surface, click the indicated button in Project Explorer. To rename each surface, do so under Properties. To rotate any surface, either manually enter an angle under Properties, or hold down the ALT key and click to move clockwise or counterclockwise. To vary the lengths on two sides of a surface, change the Width Rear parameter under Properties. Another option is to hold down shift on the keyboard, then click and drag a selected corner. Since only two sides may be different dimensions, the surface must be rotated 90 degrees to offer varying lengths on the other two sides. Once the model is complete, there are three available views that may be utilized. First is ISO or free view. Use Ctrl plus or minus to zoom in and out, and hold down the scroll wheel to pan. Next is Section or Side View. Type in different cross sections to view varying results. And finally is Plan or Top View, which is the view used for the majority of this video. Before moving on, be sure to select the audience ear height. 